Hello everyone, welcome to Gaming with a Dad. I'm the dad, Steve. Who? This is Zach, the gamer. You use that controller, Steve! Thanks everybody for watching. So as long as I've been a Call of Duty fan and as long as I've been an, uh, an esports fan, I've never been to an event. Oh, now that really surprises me, dude. Um, well, at PAX, they've had like Halo events and stuff and um, I watched the first, well, I didn't watch, but I was there when the guy won the first Magic the Gathering arena. Um, Cause they released like MTG arena released a game and um, like they held their first like $250,000 tournament uh, at PAX last year. So I was there when the guy won, like, so I've been around, but I've never like actually went and watched like a full uh, event. I'm just gonna go. I'm, I'm ready to kill some stuff, man. It's been a stressful week, dude. And I just need to murderize some things, man. man. We've been doing that the entire session so far. <laughs> you ready for this? Oh, look, all the stuff is gone now. Weird. Yeah, it was just a visual bug. Cool. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Look at this. It's like I troubleshoot things for a living. Listen to me. You think they're giving me a refund for COD at this point? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> they read the email out loud. They're like, <laughs> they're like, nope. Fuck you. <laughs> like, if you can get here, you can get a refund. Hold on, I'm gonna snipe this dude. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me sell all my stuff. Huh? Let me sell. Dude, let's clear our inventory. Let's do this smart. Let's clear our inventory. Let's go in there. And what are we gonna do, Steve? We're gonna loot, shoot, and dive. Yes! I, I, You know what? I thought you were gonna say something significantly more silly than that, but I like it. You sell all your stuff? You don't remember how to sell, do you? Yeah, I'm hitting X. X? I just click it. Is oh, e. No, e. Sorry. I don't, oh, yeah. I don't know what I'm selling, dude. But I'm selling it. Dude, you know uh, when I do the editing now and there's these long pauses, I just leave it on your face. <laughs> do you? Yeah. <laughs> it's just more of a funny thing for me than it is for anything. <laughs> Which is a little mean. And the viewers will now know. Alright. You don't understand that reference, do you? No, I, don't, I, I have no idea what you're talking about. It's an old World of Warcraft video. Where they're like, um, they're outside of a an area in a raid. Oh, they, oh, let's talk about this, buddy. Whoever just hit me with those grenades. Uh, so okay. the guy is, um, they're like outside. And they're talking about like the statistics, and he's like, "Oh, okay, well, you know, you're gonna do this, we're gonna do that. Like, this is how we're gonna do this." And the guy's like, "All right, time's up. Uh, let's do this, Leroy!" And then just runs <laughs> in to the raid and suicides. <laughs> oh man. Hey, you know what, man? I think last week was one of those weeks where I can honestly say, I missed you at the school, man. There's some really? times where I'm like, I'm glad he wasn't here for this, because he was just going to make my life harder in this situation. No, that would never happen. But now, I can honestly say, there are some situations I'm like, whoa, at least in this situation. <laughs> like, oh, 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 that guy's got a mock off cocktail. Steve, I had your back in more situations than I didn't. Yeah, hey, yeah. All right, so there's a guy out here. That has a Cyclops visor on, running around, murking people. I don't know if he's Gale, on our side. Gail Hag? Who? What are you that, sound, about? that sounds like a washed up old R&B singer, dude. Yeah, you, didn't watch, you didn't watch any of the Grammys, did you? No, I don't care. T-Wood was there. Huh? T-Wood? Yeah. Tyrone Woodley? Tyrone, Tyrone Woodley. My That's man. My man. Actually, you know what's funny? I was uh, listening to Matt Sarah talk about him, and he's like... He basically said people have forgotten how dominant of a champion he was, and he's like he kind of thinks that Tyron Woodley's forgotten how dominant he was. Dude, dude, I heard someone say that um, if he fought Kamara Usman again, he would beat Usman. Uh, I'm hard pressed to believe that, but it might have been Chael. I'm still hard pressed to believe it, and it's not because I don't think he can't beat Usman. It's just based off of that performance. I don't think he can. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. You just and forgot how dominant of a champion he was. You just said that. No, no, no. But based on how he... That was a he... bad performance. Dude, uh, based on the way he loses, like, Usman would have his number. Unless he, he drastically makes a difference. That, you know, it changes in his plan that I think a lot of people should make, which is learn how to throw more than one punch, right? Uh, you know you know what I didn't want to do with this entire session was get into fighting talk. Oh, I feel you know like what, that's dude. our our least watched stuff is our fighting talk. You know why? Which is which sucks because that's the stuff that we enjoy the most. That's because most people can't handle real man stuff, dude. All right, 
Oval Team UFC. Nothing more American. Okay. <laughs> Oval Team UFC. I like it. I absolutely like it. Castor oil, baby. There we go. There we go. And NASCAR. Yeah, I hate NASCAR. Me too. <laughs> I can't. It's one of those things I sat down one day. I was like, I'm going to get into this because so many people love it. I was like, this is nonsense. I can't I've do it. NASCAR <laughs> race. Really? Yeah. Um. So I never pass up like any opportunity to go to any. No, not even that. But like any opportunity to go to any sporting event. Right, especially one that I've never been to before. NASCAR is actually kind of cool in person. Is it? Yeah. Were you, were you drunk? No, I was like fucking th 14. Oh, come on. You were drunk, dude. Touch her. No, I was like 14. It was, we went like, immediately after one of my baseball games. I literally was still in my baseball uniform by the time we got to the, uh, the hotel. Really? Yeah. Like we literally like, it was like a night game and we left immediately after me and my dad. And we went and went to Dover to watch a, a race. It was actually kind of fun. Uh, I had a friend once that was super. Actually, no, he wasn't a friend. He was a crony scumbag that I knew, and uh, he was super into it. He was trying to break it down for me one day, and I was like, "Ah, oh, man, you can forget and forget this because I'm not going to remember any of the stuff you're saying. Because if there's rules to this, I don't understand them." Yeah, no, I mean, it's interesting. Um, I don't like NASCAR as much as I like um, like F1. Right, like other mm. racing. Other racing is way right. more compelling because it's actually, there's a little bit of a difference to it other than like kind of oval racing, right? Um, yeah. Especially street racing, not street racing, but like um, road racing, I should say, is way more interesting. But you want to talk about some, I just fell off the map. What do you I mean just, you I fell, just off, the fell map. off the map? Into a glitch? No, no. I just died. I just fell back, backwards off of, the, off of the map. That's all right. I'll wait for you to get back, bro. All right, I'm coming. Um, but yeah, racing is like super interesting to me. Uh, NASCAR. Totally different uh, subject. Dude, uh, you know what was really boring to me sometimes to watch? And this might just be because I wanted to be doing it as opposed to watching it. Street League. Could not get into it watching it, dude. Uh, you know what? I actually, oddly enough, never gave Street League a chance. Really? You know, I thought it was going to be boring. You know why? Naja was in it. Naja's gonna win every single time. And what did Naja do? Won like nine out of ten in a row or something? See, that's it. And that's the curse of being a dominant champion in anything, huh? It's like people aren't gonna watch because you're so good. DJ. DJ had that same issue. Yeah. You were talk uh, you're talking about fighting again. Naja was so he's so good. Right, and on the women's side, uh, Letitia Buffoni is so good, other than the fact that she's like had five fucking leg surgeries in the last like two years. Like, they're so good. It doesn't even make sense to watch because the other people are just kind of there. Not really there to compete. I mean, they're there to compete, obviously, but... But it's almost non-competitive. Yeah. Yeah, especially against oh. Naja, dude. That guy, was, that guy is so good. Like, day one, after coming back from, like, ankle surgery or something, like, he was doing Dominate. crazy stuff, dude. It's, you, you said that's still a thing, right? Street League? But it's just not on ESPN or Fox Sports 1, right? What is it on now? I don't know what it's on. Yeah, it is still a thing. They're still they're still doing events all over the world. It's actually, I think it might even be more popular now than it's ever been. Uh, were you impressed by Cyborg's performance? I didn't watch. He's in what? No. She's in what organization? Now? Organization Bellator. Oh, who cares? <laughs> Sorry, Bellator. You know what I did see though? It was uh, Aaron, Aaron Pico. It looks pretty good. Oh yeah. Yeah. I didn't watch any of that stuff. I don't even know how to watch it nowadays. I'm like, it's not even on it's Spike zone, anymore. Bro, it's on the zone. It first of all, what is that? <laughs> I don't know what that it's, is. It's, it's, hold on, hold on. It's the Paramount Network, first of all. Oh, I'm racist. sorry. Paramount. <laughs> are they a race? I'm sorry if I. Uh... They are. They are uh, a Cretan of people. Would you sure. stop looting all the ammo? Dude, we both get it. No, that's a lie. Every time you say that, I never get anything. <laughs> <laughs> Zach, I'm fucking. <laughs> <laughs> I can only take so much ammo. Let's be fair. Wait, I'm switching out. Switching on the gun here. Bye, Steve. No, don't leave me. Bye, Steve. Bye, I'm Steve. Coming. Bye, Steve. Yeah. I'm coming. We should play Le some Destiny. Cage o Tinks. I don't know. Like <laughs> yeah, that's more my style. Oh yeah, we get to kill these little people again. Yeah, I, you know what? I would play Destiny. I just Tiny don't. Mutants. I, I don't know if I'm into Destiny. 
I was enjoying really? playing it for a while, but like we did the same thing like five times in a row, and I was like, all right, I don't know how to do other things, and this is kind of boring. Uh, one of my buddies hit me up on the uh, IG, and he plays it, and he was like, get, jump in a game with him. But you know, it, it strikes me as the type of good is type of dude is good. I don't want to jump in if he's that good, right? I don't want to be. I mean, you're never gonna play with anyone who's better than me, so. <laughs> Especially as shooters.